Welcome back everybody, this is Nico once again, Cardboard Corner, and we got our pre-release kits today, and we're doing four, because one ain't enough, because, well, we wanted a booster box, but they're not out till next weekend, four, about, what, four, nine, thirty-six, that's one booster box, so pretty much got one right here, but we get lots of sleeves and lots of promos, and let's just find out what we got. We've been waiting this for quite a long time. Let's just move these out of the way here for now. I should open them all. Okay. Oops. Ooh, this is what everyone wants. Pre-release kit promo. Tifa. Full art. Beautiful card. We want as many of those as we can because everyone loves Tifa. Of course. Why wouldn't you? Here's Omega Weapon. Our sleeves. We're going to get a whole bunch of those today. We're not going to open any because, well... I don't know, because we don't need to open this. Oh, wait, you can't even see the sleeves. We'll put them right there. So we're just going to go ahead and open all four of these kits because, well, so we won't pause the video to open them because once we get rolling, we're going to get rolling. We're just going to mix these all up. Best we could do today, I see, is eight full arts. Worst we can do is none. So, I don't know, I'll be happy with eight. Well, of course we'll be happy with eight. I'll be happy with four, one per box. That sounds about right. Well, that sounds about average. We're not trying to be average. We're trying to be spectacular. And that's how we do it here at Cardboard Corner because, well, last Opus, we did not pull, we didn't pull any Lightning Full Arts. All we did was got two Legacy Full Arts. Athena, and that's about it. No VV. No, who else was it? No, oh, I can't even remember it. And I'm so okay. We made a three pack somehow. There we go. Start with the right one. Why not? There, we'll put those cards here. Now, first pack of Opus 14 for us, even though they're oh, they, these are harder to open than the other ones. Oh no. Cactoroni for your macaroni, right there, right on the spot. Dark Elf, Ixali, Owen. I like these black and white cards. I do. I really do. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Ifrida. First foil, Ifrida. I've been trying to get a foil Ifrida in, uh, what was it, Opus 9? Since forever. Never got one. Shiva, Lady of the Frost, our first legend, our first primal. This is, lots of these primals were... Are very how do you call it decent no not decent they're spectacular they're great these are gonna be fun cards to play with we'll put that right there oh joke if Lord of the Inferno here is another primal we'll talk about these primals later but right now we're just looking for full arts as we, we already got four so even though that's a uh... man why are these packs hard to open I can't even get on a roll. I mean, it's been three minutes in the video and I only did one pack so far. Okay, Knaf, Monk, Aerith, we got a Movis, Malaris, Ojang, Sniper, Kraken, Good, King, Mughal, Mog, another Primal, this one is just a rare. Jekt, our first uh, hero card, because we didn't get one yet. We got a Legend first pack. Man, I read through some of these cards and I can't even remember what they were. I just remember... Absolutely none of them. I remember Gilgamesh because I talked about him. I remember Shinryu. I remember... No, I don't remember Kobold or Dragoon or Lich. I remember all the chaoses, what they did. Sniper, Geomancer, Al Cid. Second legend in the box. This one's a foil. This is a great card. Al Cid is always great because, I don't know, this one. You just play 4 CP, light, Ice, Lightning, and then you can play one more card of 4 CP, of cost 4, of Ice or Lightning onto the field for the same card. It's like a buy one, get one free. Pretty much. Mastery. Hero card. Leviathan. Ravis. Noctis. Wait, what was it with this Noctis? I remember reading about this. Put Noctis in the break room. Choose one forward of cost 5 or less in your break zone. Play it onto the field. They couldn't even pick knock this. What was I? I was reading something and I was mixing it up and 
don't know, it's too much information, too much excitement. I don't know what I'm talking about. You guys all know this, Caius. Opus 5 Caius was better in my opinion. Pope Master Lusso, a hero card. Valfurter, another hero card. Good King Mughal, Jope, Ifrit, Lord of the Inferno. Bunch of rares. I mean, some of these rares in previous opuses would have been legends. Some of those legends would have been super legends, but there are no super legends, so we're just babbling. Hojo, another nice card. Move one forward from the game. When you do so, choose one forward in your break zone. That's less than the four that you gave out, and you can play it onto the field. Dull? No, just play it onto the field. Active. Barrett. A legend, Final Fantasy 7. Was it. Is this the card we get with the uh, booster boxes? I don't know. Could be. Here's another Hojo. We did a double tap on that one. I don't know why we call it double tap. I just do. I heard it somewhere before and I just keep saying it. Ewan, Gobleroid, Sylph, Vanu Vanu. Full common. Checked. We already got another check. Oh, I mixed the cards up. Kefka. Garuda, Lady of the Vortex, another Primal, Xenos. You know this card? I, from the first time I saw the Opus 14 uh, cover, I thought it was the Emperor from Final Fantasy 2. I'm like, why would they put the Final Fantasy 2 Emperor on the Opus 14 box if they're going with the Final Fantasies? I mean, the numbered ones. Like 13 was 13, 12 was 12, 10 was 1, but that doesn't count, Cactroni. And then 14, they went back to 2. I'm like, something's not right here. Wall. Just a regular rare. Omega, our legend. See, it just looks just like the sleeves right here. Oh, upside down. I imagine getting a full art of this in a sleeve like that. Your opponents won't know what they hit them. That, my friend, is a legend. I forgot what he does. I Ultros, everyone loves that octopus. I know Shinryu was a great card to... You reveal the top card of your opponent's deck and whatever it is, depends. You either deal damage to everyone or you draw a card. Sarah, Amalja, number one. Well, number one in the set, but Gesho, it's a big bird. Ninja, Zidane, ooh, this is a great card. This is Opus 1 Zidane, Opus 3 Zidane on steroids. Great, wonderful, beautiful card. This should not be a hero, it should be a super legend. Oh, well, you got a sale. Nice artwork. Usof. Nyrn. Oh, we didn't get a Lua yet. Opus 1, a Lua. Nah, what am I? We're on 14. Opus 14, a Lua. Is she like 5? We don't know. We'll play. Mashiri. Our hero card. Luso. Wait, let me put these up here. It's just a big glare. You guys can't see it. Luso, another hero. I got to fix on this lighting. Heidegger. I remember in the original game, he used to wear a a brown suit, and he was getting chased by an airplane. Anyone else remember that? Or am I mixing them? No, that was Heidegger. Caius again, White, Chazelle, Dark Knight, Abura. Oh, I see it. Garland, our first full art. It's also a legend. We are one. We need seven more to go. But, ooh, another Zidane. Put him right there. Zidane couldn't go right there. We're almost at a playset of Zidane. Did that card come in the full art? I guess we'll find out. We got videos. We got boxes. We got lots more pre-release kits. I was going to offer you guys uh, pre-release kits at 45 bucks shift, but I already sold them all. Sorry about that. But here's a bard. He's a common. Shantoto. He's a hero. I don't know. It's like Opus, no, none of them can beat Opus 1 Shantoto. Correct me if I'm wrong, tell me in the comments, say, Mr. Nico from Cardboard Corner, you know, have no idea what you're talking about. And I'll say, I agree, and I'll say, also keep saying that same line over and over again. Lakshmi, Lady of the Bliss, another primal. That's a nice looking card. I can't believe how I missed some of these. I was up, keeping up on spoiler season, and then I guess I didn't and then they all came out at the end all at once and I was trying to look at them all to get the reviews going 
if you go to cardboardcorner.com we're about to post the fire adele our rare roche our hero card it was fun finding him in uh the remake for the first time and that's all i got up to i think i'm uh i played uh, like maybe five hours and i'm still in the beginning i just don't have time to play anymore that's a nice card toneberry everyone loves toneberry you love fighting toneberry time age Stern Leonis, a hero card, Uzaf, Hojo, Garuda, Lady of the Vortex. What was it? where's Toneberry? Ah uh, yes, I was Well you'll read in the reviews, I was complaining how they should have had Toneberry like the other monsters where you keep putting a monster counter on them and every when you finally decide to use his ability he deals two thousand for each counter on him. Altimesia rare Susano Lord of the Revel was this one yes this is the Shantoto fire part 2 the previous one was uh come on we just saw him in this previous uh, opus oh my god it slips my mind his name was he was in the star deck shadow bringers um I don't know if I'm well, there we go. Dragoon, Old Leonis Steiner, Uxali, Bagaman, Palin, Don Corneo, Chio Mancer, Mont Leonis. 11 cost. But it goes down for every Earth character you control. I would have thought that playing the game, Mont would have had uh, some kind of synergy with uh, Mashari, but he doesn't. And so, I was wrong on that. But that's okay. I've been wrong plenty of times. I'll be wrong plenty of times again. Kuja, Thornberry, Pachan, Sniper, Nezhing, Queena. Blue Mage, she does play like uh, Final Fantasy IX Queena. See, she discard one monster, draw one card. That means she eats the monster because that's what she did in the game. You draw one card, Queena gains powers, everyone's happy. And she's also a foil. Cloud of Darkness, hero card. Travis, Ifrit, Hojo. Okay. So we got five legends so far. I don't think I missed one, not yet. But we're trying to go and find some more. Kraken, Goblin, Sephiroth. Probably no one's going to play the Sephiroth, but that's okay. Dark Elf, Common, Mom Bomb. Oh, I like this card. I'll get back to it. Il ah, there's our first Lua. You can go over there. Lua. Like, I remember first seeing this card the first time. I'm like, why is it in black and white? And I said, I like it in black and white. Mom Bomb. More of, ah. If you control three fire backups, she turns into a forward, and when she is put into the break zone, she deals 5,000 damage to all forwards, including your own. She is a bomb. She does act like a bomb when she takes damage, and so she destroys everyone. Just like in Final Fantasy IV, when you fought her on... When you fought the four, six bombs on the mountain, you beat them up, they turn into a bomb, mom bomb. Here's Chichu. Chichu, I know a guy named Chichu. Al Cid, another legend. This time he's not old. Foil, Altimesia, Miraga Fennis, and another Ifrita. This card, Ifrita, shall play very good with the other Ifrita. And lots of Ifrits. Here we go. Tifa, Foil, Tifa, Foil. Oh, she's only a hero? I think she was a, a legend. Oh, well, those ones are better. Lugay. I forgot what he does and I can't read. I've been up all day and X death, Thumper, not just Shalheim. Well, we'll read it, why not? Because when a forward enters your field, you may remove Lugay from the game. If you do so, that forward gains plus 2000 and Brave. This effect does not end at the end of the turn. Give that to Gilgamesh. You'll thank me later. Oh, even more. Who else? Who was the other? Primal, who was, uh, can attack four times. We're probably going to get him soon. Tiamat, Common, Gesho. Oh, he was a hero? Why did I put him in that pile earlier? 
Half a mile carbuncle. Let me make some rooms before I knock cards over. No one likes to see that. No one wants to knock over cards. And by the time you see this video, we'll know that Red 13 is a great card. We already know he's a great card. Stern Leonis, hero. See, Red 13's got a spin round, baby, right round. Like a record. So what's wrong with these packs? They weren't used to be like that. It seems like they're extra. How come Kais is always the first card we've been drawing recently? Ultros. Foil rare. Susano, Lord of the Revel. Hero card. Oh, that's our second one. We can almost build a playset. Almost. Not quite. Almost. One well, of the next boxes that were open, we're probably going to get a little more in-depth in the with the cards that we're pulling. Four of these just a common. I mean, damage, three points of damage you receive. I'm talking like Yoda now. We'll give all your standard unit forwards plus 3,000 power. Van. Play Skyrits, you play this Van. None of the other ones. Another red 13 there, we saw him. Great card, what? Great, great card. It'll help you get Susano early, easily. Vanu Vanu. Corsair. Tamlin out. Our hero card, Kefka, Ultimessia. Red oh, plenty of red 13s in a row. What is this? We're almost through the third box and only got one full art? Come on, that can't be right. We need a couple more. And just so you guys know, I have a feeling that we're going to run out of space on this camera. But here is Sin. He's our hero card. So we're just going to try and go hurry up. And before we do run out of space, I'm going to say go to CardboardCorn.com if you're still watching. Uh, like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. Leave us a comment. Uh, Nath, our hero. Guts go. Oh, this is a great card too. Guts go. Fire. Every time he enters the field... He attacks, you take one card from the top of your deck, remove it from the game. When he finally gets broken, you take all those cards that were removed from the game, and you put them in your hand. And after that, you might have 15 cards in your hand. It's your turn to play. You play all these forwards, all these backups, you attack, and hopefully you win the game. You go there. Ketone. Full of rare Gilgamesh. Ha 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 ha. This is a great card. I remember when they first pulled it. See, these two cards go great together, especially if you play lots of multi elements and get them all in your break zone. You'll be happy. Probably win the game. Believe me. I know what I'm talking about. I'm a professional. Not really. Nope. Kojin. Man, I'm running out of room over here. Roche, Exteth, Efrita, lots of Efritas, lots of Exteths. I've seen lots of Caiuses. No cloud. I have a feeling we're going to have the same thing that happened. Ooh, hoo, hoo, I see something. I see something. The Emperor. Legacy full art right here. Wonderful legend. The character's opponent. Controls cannot use special or action abilities look at that it's a beautiful card put them right here next to garland tifa so two full arts one is a legacy card we got we might have a chance because i did mix them up so there might be more than a couple of full arts in the last couple of packs gabranth a rare calabrina control three or more earth backups she becomes a forward as well i mean she should have had some play with luca but if luca is a backup she does typhoon typhon i thought it was typhoon ultros's friend right there he is not a legend he's probably just a rare i forgot hero he's a hero card yes he is luso another hero card I gotta find some room. I'm gonna push these to the side a little more. 19 minutes. Oh, we're almost at 20 minutes. 
20 minutes, four packs left. You can see the pile of packs just crumbling down slowly. Gold Bez, our hero card. Basically, at the beginning of your attack phase during each of your turns, reveal the top card of your deck. If it's of court, forward of cost three or less, play it onto the field. And then you can put four characters in the break zone and gain control of any character. Sounds kind of like Kane. Hmm. I think it does. Let's see now. Three, four packs. Nath, Pujo, Merylis, Don Corneo, Golbez. Oh, we just pulled this card. Shinryu, our legend. This is the great card. Oh, just pull the top card of your opponent. It's a Ford. Deal nine, seven thousand. Oh, all they all lose seven thousand power. If it's not a four, draw two cards. You can go right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine legends so far. Nine legends. Hey, it's almost like a, we opened the booster box. You just need a couple more. No, it won't even work. This is pretty much what you get out of a booster box. Calibrain, our hero card. Shiva, Lady of the Frost. Another legend. Ooh, we got ten. A primal as well. Oh, that's our second Shiva. We haven't even pulled the... Wait, you go there. No, we haven't pulled the... How many pulls? One, two... That's it? Did I misplace cards somewhere else by accident? I might have. Cactroroni foil. Calabrina hero. Yeah, that's it. Hold on, I'll count in a second. But that is our legend pile. Bunch of hero cards over there. Bunch of more Tifas in here. Full Tifa somewhere in here. Aerith, White Mage, Magon, Kojin, Geomancer. I know we didn't get a full art, but we got Ifrit. We got a rare foil and Barret, another legend. Right there, Ramu, Lord of Eleven, Ifrita. That is our packs. We got a couple of doubles up here. Plenty of cards. Well, that was our big uh, shebang or whatever you call it. These were the top cards. And this one here. And this one here. And both these all sids. Wait. We only got one legend foil? It can't be, right? I thought we had more. Anyways, 23 minutes in this video. I appreciate everyone watching. I know we missed a couple of uh, weeks, but I miscounted the 13 pre-release kits I had left. And now we're on to Opus 14. We got plenty of booster boxes, plenty more pre-release kits. We're going to open them all. We're going to look for Cloud this time and maybe the full art of Shinryu. I know there's a Barrett too and whatnot, but thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. Uh, what else is there? Upvote, downvote, and then just go to CardboardCurtain.com, read some of the articles I write, tell me what you want to see. I mean, you got any ideas for videos? We can try something new instead of just box openings. So thank you very much. Have a good night. Now let's get some decks going.